Hey there, are you having trouble with CLR Browser Plugin not installing itself correctly? When you go to Plugins, it actually shows up here, but when you right-click on Sources to ins to add a CLR Browser, it there is no option here? Well, I can actually help you with that. I had that problem myself, and this is how you fix it. Uh, first thing you want to do, and so we're just going to type it into Google, CLR Browser Plugin. For some reason, I felt like I spelt that wrong. And just click the first one, the obsproject.com. Okay, now basically you got to follow these steps, and you, I don't know why. Like I thought I followed these steps to a T, and I actually was messing up. And I think a lot of people are messing up in this aspect. So make sure you install the 32-bit version here. If you're using the 64-bit version, make sure you save it to this location, C Program Files OBS slash Plugins. Now, the only difference is this is 86. That depends on your operating system, if you have a 64-bit or a 32-bit operating system. Uh, so make sure you install the, right, the, the correct one. And if you can't really figure out which one you have, just follow the paths and install both if you have to. Um, the next thing you need to do is update your MSC Visual C++ runtimes to 2013. Uh, basically click this link, click download, and then pick the one that corresponds to what you need. So if you're running on a 64-bit version system, click here. If you are running on a 32-bit version system, click here. Other than that, once it's done downloading, you install it. Uh, don't just download it and think it's done. Actually run the program once you're done. That's the problem that I had is I forgot to run the actual program that it installs. Uh, next thing, I did the exact same thing with this too. So click here, web install. We're going to click download again. It's going to want to do the download right away. I've already done this, so make sure you save the file, and after you've saved the file, run the file. Don't just think it's done. Like, you, you download it, it's good. Make sure you run it. Okay? Uh, after you've done, done that, make sure your OBS, you give it a good restart, and it should work. You should be able to come back here. Come back over to here, and when you open it up, you'll be able to right-click and add a... CLR browser to your scene. So there you go. Hopefully this was able to help you out. If it was, please like and subscribe, guys. Thank you very much. Have a great day.